My name is Joshua Austin. I'm a restorative dentist in San Antonio, Texas, and a proud Seattle Study Club member. A couple of years ago, I started having a lot of postoperative sensitivity with my composites. That was a problem I had never really had before. So I really sat down and I broke down every step of the process. And what I found was a problem with my curing light. My assistant had dropped the curing light and broken the light guide off, and she was afraid that I'd be angry, so she super glued it back together. And it still put out bright blue light. It actually didn't look any different than it did before, um, but I didn't know about it. When I held it up to the photometer, it was putting out about 10% of the output that it should. Only about 90% of the light was gone. So basically nothing I was putting in to, to, for direct restorations was, was getting cured and so that's where the sensitivity problem came from. We bond a lot of things in dentistry today. So the curing light is really the most important instrument in your whole entire office. And so you have to be checking your curing light on a regular basis. You can get a photometer for, for fairly inexpensive and check them once a month you know, once every other month, something like that, just to make sure that your, your output of your curing light is at maximum power. Otherwise, you can have a lot of problems.